Hello everyone, welcome back to Ace Combat X, Skies of Deception. Last mission we took down the, the unit units on the planes, and Unfortunately, oh no, the special AA unit moved over to the radar place. They have the steps to the That's bad. Alright. Let's see, I think I'm going to buy myself another something for my... Whoops. Wait, first I want to see what aircraft I unlocked. Whoops. 14. Kerber. Oh, must have unlocked the F-18. That's a cool plane. But I think I want to get myself a special weapon for that Tomcat, wherever that is. Napalm. Yeah, we want a guided bomb. Not a big fan of the napalm ones. Got it. Aim them quite precisely for them to work well. Yeah, let's see mission 9B. Yeah, we'll do a, an air to ground escort with an F-14. Though I did that a lot with Ace Combat 5. Sachana Air Base is our country's largest air base. The enemy incurred heavy losses during the previous battle at Kalana Steps resulting in a near complete loss of air power in this area. However, enemy ground troops have already begun to form a formidable intercept force in their stead. The surrounding woods would put our ground troops at a distinct disadvantage, so a helicopter unit will be used to carry them in. All right. Your mission, sir, will be to protect the helicopter unit until they can safely land at the target. Intelligence reports that enemy troops trained in guerrilla warfare and familiar with the terrain are holding this point. Infrared sensors have been attached to the HUD to help locate enemies hiding in the forest. Cool. The heat signature fancy. from an enemy's weapon will appear on the HUD whenever they fire. Use this chance to lock onto the target. Draw enemy fire and take out as many enemy positions as possible to ensure the safety of the helicopter unit. All right. Let's start the mission and grab ourselves an F-14 Tomcat. And all right, we got a special skin, works for me. All right, 16 missiles and I think 18 GPBs should be a good amount. 10 GPBs, I misread that. So you're the famous Griffith Squadron. I've heard the stories. We're counting on you. All right, we're just going to concentrate on making... Oh, is this going to be like Mission 10 in Ace Combat 7? Where you got to find the air-to-air missiles? On. Where are you, RPG guys? Oh, spotted one. Wish I had long range missiles. Come on. Alright. I'll just stay right above my helicopter people. Oh, yeah, these Schnooks are kind of hard to keep up with. They're very slow. Oh, man. RPGs. Um, um, whoa. No, my helicopter. Oh, shoot. Lost my target. Come 
Come on. Where are those RPGs? These guys flying about the river. Oh, there we go. It's not a bad plan. It won't save you, but... Oh, damn it. It's too slow. Oh, God, no. No. Come on, where's the other one? Cool. Another one. This is my first time playing the mission. It's kind of hard to judge, like, what the ideal distance I should be, like, keeping from the helicopters is. I just kind of try to stay back from where they are. Oh. Wait, there's an RPG, and there's another RPG. Oh, that was close. This plane's not the best for ground attack, obviously. That could be hit. That's hit. Oh, man. Oh, shit. Don't hurt the helicopter squadron. Can't let you do that. Alright. Be nice if I could just run on over to the whatever you call it, that cluster of targets over there. But now I gotta babysit some helicopters. Oh, there we go. Oh shoot, you kinda slipped. Alright, so, looks like I've already taken down, these ones were 300 then, um, I think I've taken down at least 20 RPGs, I guess that makes sense because my plane started with about 62 missiles. Hey, now we can finally, hopefully start attacking the real targets. Oh no. Still got someone with the rocket launcher. I like how they display the target on the top left. It's a cool feature. Makes it easier to know what you're shooting at. Oh, just some patchy. Oh, shoot. Gotta go back to save the CH-47s. Or they can be 46s. I can never tell. I kind of really like having that special weapon binding be on the X button. In my opinion, like, it's nice to be able to just change it by, whoa, missiles, Jesus. That thing was blinking like crazy. It's nice to be able to just change missiles with your left hand. Fire. Oh, shit. I will. I will do my best. Alright, all we got left is a SAM, which could definitely be troublesome for the helicopters. But I assume it's not going to be too much after this. Oh! Damn it. GPB didn't hit. And oh, there's a B 52 there that I missed. Okay, guess I'm doing that. Totally didn't mean to, but whatever. Right. Who's left? You know, just land your helicopters now. 
on, you're at the base. Although there's only two of you left. There we go. Oh, got a landing for this mission. Looks like I'll be landing out of that base I just captured. Pretty cool. Love it when they do that in Ace Combat. It's kind of like Mission 14 in um, Skies Unknown. And if you're wondering why I'm talking about Skies Unknown so much, it's because I finished recording that series today. And if I'm fast enough, I might be able to also finish Skies of Deception today, because this is a very short game by Ace Combat standards. Not in a bad way. In fact, I think that kind of works in its favor. Missions are just, like, I don't know. It doesn't feel like they're just kind of filler. Which is sometimes a problem with Ace Combat. Perfect, sir. I landed crazy early. The helicopter unit has brought Sachana Air Base under their control. The mission is a success. Air power from the base will be a vital asset, especially in the battle to retake Griswold. I have the feeling the day of our capital's liberation is not far off. Cool. And I only got a B rank. It's par for the course for Ace Combat X parts. Alrighty guys. Next mission will probably be going to that industrial complex, so stay tuned for that. Have an awesome day.